Spirituality reminds me that whatever it is I've put out is going to come back to me. It's the cause and effect, the boomerang story, karma, which means that I understand deeply that if I've done something wrong, unless I sort it out and put it right, it's going to come back to me, maybe even multiplied, to teach me more lessons, because that's how the boomerang works, comes back with even greater force. And so when I understand this, I say, I want to be able to move forward. I want to be able to experience peace and maybe even freedom. It's a very popular word, freedom. Everybody wants freedom, but we don't know how to achieve it or even what it is really. And so when I start looking inside and I see that there are things that I've done that I need to seek forgiveness for, but also I need to have the inner power to be able to change. Um, it serves very little purpose to be able to say sorry and then carry on with the same habits. And most times this is what happens. I can let go of something, but then I carry on with the same pattern of behavior. And so when I say sorry, now with spirituality and realization, then I realize deeply how I need to change, forgive myself and the same for others. What was my response when somebody wronged me? Am I able to change my responses to them and be able to forgive them so that I can be free to move on? I can move forward without carrying a burden. And so I see that spirituality teaches me all of these things which rearranging the furniture in my head wouldn't necessarily do. Spirituality means coming to that inner experience of peace, of love, of truth, of joy. And if I'm not able to forgive, am I peaceful? Am I loving? Am I able to follow the path of truth? Am I able to experience joy in my life? So literally, it's absolutely a fact that unless I go through the process of very consciously releasing and forgiving, I can't experience the power of spirituality in my life.